Let's unbox the Gigabyte RTX 4070 Windforce OC graphics card. This is not a brand new card. It came from Amazon Warehouse, but we can still have a look at what this graphics card looks like and what kind of features it offers. There are, there are no accessories. It looks like this box never had any accessories to begin with. This is a budget-friendly model, so I do not expect anything special from it. And take a look at this. It looks normal, about what you'd expect. Plastic shroud. And this is not premium plastic by any means, just your usual black plastic. In terms of display connectivity, we get one, two, three display ports and one HDMI. The card is 265 millimeters long and it takes up about two and a half slots. Power is delivered via this single 8-pin power connector. And have a look at this backplate. It goes all the way over here. And this is metal. That's nice. And this cutout right here, that helps with cooling. There are three heat pipes cooling the GPU. So this is not a high-end cooler. However, it might be good enough. To find out, you'll have to watch my full review on my main channel. I'll link it in the description below. Check it out. The review will be up probably in about a week or so, once I thoroughly test this graphics card. The memory chips, as well as the power delivery system, are cooled by this aluminium plate that is attached to the heatsink. That's always good to see. And same on the bottom. We've got some thermal pads connecting the memory chips as well as the power delivery system to the heatsink. Nice. And take a look at the PCB. It is really short. It stops right there. There are no RGB LEDs of any sort. This is all painted on. This is a very simple design. But this card is pretty easy on the eyes. Let me know, what do you think about this graphics card? And if you're interested in it, then you can find it at the link in the description below. Don't forget to like this video if you enjoyed it, and subscribe for more if you haven't already. It was I, Vadim, until next time.